Hello everybody and welcome once again to Lost Souls. Now I've upgraded to the release version which is 1.0.4 and as you can see I have got some more armour on and in fact I just got some more armour. Let's just take these. What do they go to? I can't put them on yet can I? <laughs> I need a bit more. What do I need? Defence 5 and Agility 3. So I've got a few tips. Um, let's first one I've got from Psycho. Um, he tells me that I can basically make a, a pickaxe with copper handle and I'll get it, or any tool in fact with a copper handle from Tigger's Contract and I'll get XP. And I've got three tips from Zero Life too. One of them is I can use Ore Excavator and set the pattern and I'm trying to figure that out. I haven't quite figured it out yet but if I look at the, um, the controls we go down to the bottom, Ore Excavator is right at the bottom of think oh, near the bottom anyway I was looking I was looking at this one here the level up GUI with an L on it so maybe we could open that one up a lot of these got conflicts like hover mode so it, which isn't so great um, and the gravity or excavator one and the shift toggle is V now V's it might be bad one this one let's just re let's just turn this one off so that ref gets rid of the V it doesn't there's quite a few which you've got uh, duplicates. Let's see if I can find another V quickly. Remove that one. Cycle item mode. I don't use that one either. Let's just get rid of that one as well. Where has it gone to? Right, V. So shape toggle edit. Done. So let's go back to the game. And press L this time so I get the level the level up GUI. Okay. Actually, I didn't expect that to see that one. <laughs> Last time I looked at this, I got a different one. Never mind. <laughs> so you've got mining, crafting, and combat. So you can then upgrade your tools. So basically, cooking speed and the level cost is eleven. I'm not going to do that yet. Crafting specialization is what we can do. Fishing, green thumb, and these all got 11 costs. Actually, that one's got five costs, but I need the other ones first of all. Let's get the other ones done. Let's concentrate those on when we got some more of the the key skills. Well, well I think the key skills are. So let's go up this one here. We've got to, um, I need to get agility up to three, don't I? That's, that's only a four, so that's not too bad. And I've got seven left. What else do I need for the golden boots? It was defense, wasn't it? I need defense of five. I probably can't do that one. Oh maybe. So now I can put these boot uh, these on. Okay, good. So now I've got unbreaking three, magnet three, and fire protection four. Well, that's a pretty good against those. So what's my armor protection like? Oh, it's looking a bit better. So let's go and test the magnet. I think I hope it'll bring this um, the cactus to me. I've been losing cactus on the thing, so let's get on with that. Anyway, everybody, thank you for your tips. They're great. And nope, <laughs> it went the other way. Oh. I got lost again, which is which is a shame. I'm having that problem. In fact, I was just coming out here just a minute ago, and I got I saw one of those blazing juggernauts. It's one over there, look. And I managed to. Cr it was one of the fiery ones. Or I'm not sure the fiery ones, the purple ones. And he's the one that drops the leggings. And I think he dropped the chest plate. Well, no, the chest plate was dropped by something else. So I can't get out of there yet. I've got to wait for him to go away. But what I want to do today is I wanted to get the water up again. But I'm, it's going to take a while before I'm going to get these. Oh, this one's, this one's good. So hopefully we can get this one. I'm not sure where the best place to be is. If I go in here and break that one, maybe I get it. No, but it's gone and broken again on the wrong thing, hasn't it? In that case, let's just remove this one. I should need a shovel for sand and remove this one because they keep breaking on this one. Let's get rid of it. Right, I picked it up this time. So I've actually got the one. And then I stand a better chance of picking them up, don't I? So I probably should remove that sieve as well, bring it back. Then I could put the four here. It's safer to do it inside than to go outside. The other thing I was doing, the bonsai tree, and look at these bonsai trees, dropping saplings, leaves, 
at apples, which is actually a good rate because that means you've got uh, shears to do that, isn't it? Twigs and stones. So um, planks was pretty good. And it actually, the tree was the one I right clicked it with. I didn't realise that until I watched the video back again. I clicked it with a tree, and it was happened to be an oak tree. Probably the best one, isn't it? So that was the, the those were two of the three tips that uh, Zero Life gave me, and the other tip was was I could use shift to place blocks, but that restriction has actually gone away. Two reasons for that. One is I uh, I got my whichever one it was magnet building up another layer. I think and that was all I needed to do. But it's also gone, so you could also place blocks from the beginning, which is actually less confusing to everybody, I reckon. So where's he gone away? He? No, he's still over there. And he's coming this way. <laughs> what I've got to do is, I don't really want to attack these guys, but they are a pain, I must be honest with you. Let's just see if we can put another block down here. Like that. Maybe another one as well. Let's put one down here like that. He can't get through there. Now he's got to come over. Oops, he's already come over it. Put that put down there. Right, good. Phew, that was a bit stressful. <laughs> I can tell you. So I need an axe just to chop this one away. I'll just take this axe out to feel like this. Make sure I don't hit uh, the button at the same time. Now, what's his levels? He's got quite a lot of health, hasn't he? So let's just hit him with the axe a few times and get rid of him. See, that's surprising. I normally haven't survived one of their hits. Oh, we've got a few bits and pieces, including XP, which is great. Now, what I was trying here was I was trying to grow another wall, but it's definitely not worked. It's been like that for ages now, and I don't know what I've had to do. Let's just chop this away now. But I don't understand where this has gone for the GUI for this. So if I press V, oh, that's actually gave me two slaps back. So if I press V when I'm doing this, or is it V? Ah, yes, there we go. So it does work. I have to get rid of the thing. So the shape heads give eight, three by three, five by five, none, or one by two. So let's go back to none again. Oops, missed it. And go and get some. We've got some. Uh, Iron ore up here, I noticed just a minute ago when I was coming around. So we need our pickaxe, and the best one to use, I think, is probably the iron pickaxe. Getting a bit worn out, but oh yeah. So what did I get there? Get down there gently and pick those bits up. Did I pick them up? Yes, good. So we got from there 21 nuggets. I think that was four pieces of iron ore. That doesn't seem to be too bad. Let's have a look. I can claim these as well. I'm going to get see if I can pick up these. I got that one that time. Good. Oh no, it's there. Look. And it didn't break. Phew. I picked up that one. I was near enough to it. So I was going to just put these two down here. Oh, three I've got. which is good because that means we're a good, on the way to get some water. I'm still not sure if I've got these in a good position or not. I will be honest with you. Let's pick up that slab. Why didn't it stay there? Okay, good. So we need eight juices and then we can make our bucket of water. In fact, we might even be able to speed this up. Let's see if I can get this bucket of water out of here. I can, great. Because it didn't work for that, so it doesn't really matter so much, does it? So I've got a bucket of water, and I should have a bucket of lava in here, or somewhere. Where has it gone to? I did check the, co the quests, and I couldn't find a quest for the one I was wanting to do, which is the one for... Um, so where has the bucket of lava gone to? Let's get rid of these while I'm here. Ah, there we go. 
I think we need some stone. If we don't need some stone, we need some stone slabs. And I know I've got those as well. Let me just take this out of here like that and put the nuggets in here. So we've got 27. That's good. That's uh, exactly three three block three ingots of iron. Let's get rid of these. Don't need these. We'll get rid of the the armor as well that I've got as extra armor. This one's actually got thorns to protection fire protection one. So the, the protection two is better, I think. At least for the time being. Um, stone. There we go. So now we should be able to make the lava generator, or the cobblestone generator. This one. So we just need one piece of glass. No, that's no big deal. We can get glass, no problem. Let's get some. I maybe we've got some in this chest here. Nope. No. I could use these. There's enough of those now. I only need four, and you have to smelt it up again. Well, we just take one piece of. So, um, sand like this. Put that in here like that. And that will give us enough to make a real cobblestone generator. And while I'm doing that, I guess. There we go. What we can also do with this now. I think we get the two buckets back again. I hope so. I oh, use that one too. Yep, we get the two buckets back again. So now we have a cobblestone generator. So let's get a chest, another chest. I need some more wood. Still haven't done the wood. I actually got plenty of wood in there. Let's get it out of here. I said that five. I haven't got plenty of wood in there. Where have I got all this wood from? That was nice. <laughs> Sort of distracted me a little bit. Where's my wood? I've got tons of planks of wood, I'm sure I've. Well, if not, let's make some more. We need two, don't we? No, we need four. Get another two out. So we go around the side here like this. We get our two back again, and we need one piece of string. One chest like that. Now we can put this chest down and on top of it we'll put the cobblestone generator. I think it'll work that way. Let's put it down. Hmm. I'm running out of space, aren't I? It's a bit messy this space. I wonder if I can put it down, say here. And put the cobblestone generator on top of it. I wonder if that'll work. Hopefully it will. Otherwise I have to make a hopper. Oh, I can't open <laughs> I can't open the chest. Um all right, picks up five pieces of cobblestone, so that's definitely working. But none went into the chest anyway, so right. I'll have to remove the chest. Or we'll find somewhere else to put it with a hopper on it, I guess is the way to do it. I'm not hundred percent sure. I've only got five pieces of iron there, so hopper's a bit on the expensive side at the moment but it's a good way four five pick up this chest as well and we make a hopper I think reckon that's probably the best use of this because cobblestone now if you got generated cobblestone even though it's slow at 32 max It's not too bad. We've got a source of making some real cobble, uh, an infinite supply of cobblestone. I'm just wondering where to, how to do this, to be honest with you. Let's put it over. That's got one space in it. That's got plenty of space in it. This has actually got plenty of space. Let's do it like this. I think this will work. I need to go and craft the hopper first of all, don't I? Let's do that. Seems really expensive at the moment to use a hopper, doesn't it? Now, if I put the cobblestone generator on top of that, we should start to get some cobblestone into here like that. And that will come in at a reasonable rate. Not very, very, very fast, but fast enough. 
and we can actually start to compress that cobblestone. Now let's have a look at that. Let's have a look at the quests. That was a lag spike. I press F4. I've got quest program on a button there. So survival. Oops, done. This is the one I've got a problem with at the moment. Was to do a bloodwood bow. Ah, yes, that's right. That's been fixed. Isn't it? I'm just talking to myself. What we can also do, of course, is now we can do um, so wooden swords. The actual recipe's coming back again. So we need some. We can make some spikes. That was one thing I was stuck on last time, wasn't it? Piece of wood will do, and that'll give me four. And then we can make two, two more swords with those. We only have to make one spike, don't we? And I think it was just a piece of wood, and what was the other thing we needed for that? Piece of wood, like that. And I think we can make a spike. We get four. And that should actually complete a quest. There we go, wooden spikes. Let's go and have a look at that quest. Now I think that is probably is it yes, here we go, look. Completed wooden spikes. Then we make stone spikes and gold spikes. So we've got four of one and we get a loop chest. Let's claim that. Done. Um So what's in this loot chest? Oh, okay, we've got this one again. And I won't have enough... Well, maybe I do. Well, now, where did I put those pieces? I think they're probably in... I've moved things around, haven't I? I forgot where I put everything. I think they're in here. Nope. They're not in here. But it's a good place for them. Anyway, I think we can put them into here. And it's in, they were in this chest here, I think. I thought they were in this chest. That's strange. Oop. Haha. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Try and do that again, this time without walking into the cactus. Okay, got it. Right, got plenty of food. Where did I put those bits and pieces? That's strange, isn't it? I think they're here. Nope. I really don't know what I've done with them. I know I've got a set of those already from one of the quest rewards, unless I've put it in a funny place, because not in there, and not in here, and not in here. I don't know what I've done with them. And it was matter very much, does it? The pistons. Or maybe that was just a different version when I was playing with a different version. I've got a lot of stuff on me here, which I don't really want. Cactus saplings string oh yeah strings in there we can get rid of the string slabs we can get rid of those don't need those at the moment I probably don't need that and I'll keep the nether rack because it's always useful to put something down now the wooden spikes we should be able to use those in some way to protect our our base one thing I could do is put them on the front of here like this couldn't I Because quite often, if I manage to block one of those um, blazing juggernauts off, I can put, if he comes here and he goes across here from side to side. Tell you what. I can't do it because I need nine magic. Haha. <laughs> All right. What have we got for magic skills at the moment? Seven. And we need seven to get the next layer of magic. Okay. There we go, it's one of these things. Ah, I get slowness from this one. This will help me with a bit of XP anyway. I don't know what's... Oh, one of them's died. One of I was suffering from at the moment. I think it's like Wither, isn't it? That gave me five anyway. And I didn't expect that. Was there any more XP dropped around here? <laughs> Go and check, you see. Oh, 
we've got some lots of zombie pigmen around a bit distracting right okay good What did I get from that? I got some more uh, inferior essence, some more glass shards. It's funny that they drop those, isn't it? And I got some more string because of that cobweb that was there. Uh, right, okay. I think I should do some more flint stiff and mess. I haven't got enough. Oh, yes, we've got plenty of iron. Look, let's complete another quest. We've got three in there we need six i'm going to break these down to the 18 that we can you break them down to so we need six of these oh that wasn't very clever that's four that do that four and that give me five and with those six we can make some more mesh and i think i should do that so we can make some iron stiffens mesh which is the next thing along flint stiffened mesh we can probably make some more flint because we've got plenty of gravel now so let's do that do we need one two we need six of these don't we and a normal mesh and i think that's how it works so we need nine of these nine string should make a mesh One mesh surrounded by flint should produce a stiffened flint stiffened mesh, like and then this round by di uh, by iron should produce an iron stiffened me mesh. What do we need for building? That's no big deal. We can do that. So that completes another quest: iron mesh. So let's go and get that one sorted out. Now iron mesh is uh, probably ex nearly ho compression that one there crafting task so we get another iron mesh and a loot back and a loot chest okay let's claim oh i didn't claim it did i <laughs> whoops just claim that one i've got as a choice okay we'll take the, we'll take the loot chest claim done you never know you either get in that particular case it wasn't brilliant but it's better than nothing at all Probably have been better off with the with the other oh, the iron stiff and mesh wouldn't I? So we've got the iron stiff and mesh in here. What are the uses of this? And we can make diamond, but what can we sieve? Okay, so we can sieve Ardite or from compressed nether gravel. In both cases. That's actually a twenty percent drop chance, that's quite high. What about the diamond ones? So uses of that. Again it's the same, this time you get but these are actually better, aren't they? 30% drop chances, 40% and 30%. Some gold ore pieces from compressed or nether gravel. How do we make nether gravel, by the way? It's just hammering. Crushed netherrack is just compressed netherrack or normal. I guess it's normal as well, don't we? Or do you have to use a compression hammer for that? Interesting. I. I'm not 100% sure, let's so have a look at the uses of that one, so we can actually sieve. In fact, you can't use a diamond sieve, do you have to use a diamond sieve on the compressed one? Okay, that's a bit confusing, isn't it? So, I just put that string back, because I don't need that in me now. Let's have a look what more quests we can do. Uh, I, really, I probably should upgrade these to stone ones. We can do that as well, actually. There's no reason why we can't do a stone one. And I need to find an application for those. That's the important bit. Cobblestone. So we need three of these ones. And that's a stone one. Stone spikes. So we need a compressed cobblestone. Okay, that's no big deal. We should have plenty of cobblestone in here now. <laughs> so we should be able to make these ones. Oops, didn't press the shift on it, did I? I'll actually complete the stone spikes. 
quest as well. More importantly for me, in the, actually, in these games, is not to do this type of stuff. Is actually to, oh, I didn't complain claim that one, did I? Oh, yes, that's the reason why I couldn't remember. I haven't chosen what to pick yet, and I still haven't chosen what to pick. Really got no idea. So that's presumably not stuff in the extra edition, so we can claim this one. We get a loot chest, claim, done. What do we get this time? Storage upgrades and the basic storage drawers. Can we actually, yes, no. So we can use a basic storage drawer now for six building, but we can't use this one. So we could actually put this storage down somewhere. In fact, it might be a good idea to put it with this. Hmm. Then what we'll do, we'll put it on top of that one. We can't upgrade it because we even with this one here, storage upgrade two. So that's four times. So we need some more building at XP for that one. Before I need to do that, I need to get the magic XP up to not up to nine, don't I? And I've got I think the seven for that one. It actually makes the game really interesting. This this business about uh, I've got some more storage stuff in here, haven't I? About the skills, but it also makes it quite challenging to think about it. See, that's 13 building, 13 building. So it doesn't matter what upgrade you've got. Okay, let's just sort that. Have to sort it there. Otherwise it pulls the item out. Right. I really do need to do something sensible at the moment, don't I? And I'm really stuck on what to do next. Oh look, that's what, one of my diamonds. That's what I said. If you can't get it, see that Z. If I click it on that Z, if I get it just outside, it might. Yeah, that might be the place. And you can put it in. If you click it on it, then it takes the one out out like that. Where's it gone to? Doesn't look right. That does it because it's put it in that one. And I usually end up with a bit that you've got here. See, I managed to pick it up that time. Anyway, I find there's a bit, just needs a bit more of a space around that. So we've got some stone spikes now. Well, I'm not making iron spikes because that requires another six. Oh, we could do. But we need some uses for it. So I guess the best way for that is to grind some mobs, but. Huh. Which ones? And how and where? That's the that's the problem we've got at the moment. We've got actually cool. Look at this lot. Yeah. Am I actually going to get any of this? Oh, we've got two of the bits. But any other bits gone down there? Let's go and pick it up. Strange noise. What's going on second me? Oh, <laughs> it was stacking me. It's the uh, cactus. Cactus is quite dangerous, especially when you look at an enderman at the same time. Oh, we got six. Okay, that means I can just about do another bucket of water. But it's uh, got that all that blood on the screen. Right, seven. So I'm going to keep doing that with cactus anyway until I've got enough cactus to actually make the four buckets of water that I need to fill in that and see if we can actually get some farming done. But I don't have a plan at the moment. That's that's my biggest problem and I really do need to get a plan. And part of the plan is really just has just been to get XP. I've still got another diamond mesh on me. And I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna get the XP. I could use wooden spikes and then just hit something that would be a good way to do it and i wanted to get a bow didn't i so i needed to do the firewood which i've got but the bow is actually a difficult one because i need the string a flame string i'm just wondering if there's a recipe for it it doesn't make sense this so there must be a way to get flame string i think that's just extracting it from carpenter 
it must be a drop from something or other, and that's Natura. So there must be some tree that drops, some animal or something that drops those, and I forgot what it is. I'll have to look it up. I'll tell you what, I'll be back in a second. Right, the drop by heat, heat scar spiders. I actually haven't seen the heat scar spiders. I'll tell you what we'll do. I'll have a quick look for one. This I haven't shown you because it's just something I was doing to do some mining. But basically I just created Oh, that's not the wrong one. That's the wrong passageway. It's just this one here. Yep. This will take us out to the, another part of the nether. I think that's the way. That's a bit of a contorted path, isn't it? I've had some stuff to mine down here, that's why there's a big hole, isn't it? And we come out here. Uh-oh, look what I can see. Those blazing juggernauts are definitely a pain. Where's he gone to over there? But I haven't seen a single I haven't seen a single spider at all in this pack yet. Oops, what's that taking me behind that? These things are these embers are real. <laughs> I'm not careful, I get killed by either the ember or the other thing to get my axe out. That'll help. Right. At least it's not one of those really killy ones that kills you in one hit. Where's it gone to? Another thing to do. He's still there, I can hear him, so let's just remove this one. somewhere he must be he's there look I can see him oops two of them ah oh, I think they're multiple spawning at the moment let's just have something to eat and well I can well, I can deal with these guys maybe it maybe the sword is the best thing to use I think with the sword you hit more than one at a time, so that's pretty good. Two hearts, I see. Oh, half a heart. Should be able to punch him, shouldn't I? Right. what XP levels they've given me. Not very much normally. Eight. Well, eight. I can do some magic. Let's get that done anyway. So we need to get magic up to nine. I'll look at the other bits when we get back home. So this bit I was doing some... Oops. Mining. <laughs> Just fell down one of the holes I created, didn't, didn't I? So There's another quart, so that will help a bit as well. Let's get that as picked up. That broke the pickaxe. Four. Have I got another pickaxe with me? I think not. Let's just take the iron pickaxe and just do the rest like this. Six. And I think I need a little bit more XP. Some redstone ore over. Let's take that while we're here. Six. What do I need for mining? E. There's another ember. Right, okay. Let's get those, just the axe out. And I think I need to get back to base, to be honest with you. I'm feeling quite vulnerable out here. I'm 
basis just here because what I did is I put some a wooden a wooden platform here to find where base was so I've now got seven I think I could do my next level layer of magic let's just do that while I'm here yep nine great now that means I can open my bag again so I've not been able to open that for quite a long time because <laughs> it had required level nine magic Actually, that was quite a good little outing, wasn't it? Quick look around. Okay, great. What did we pick up for redstone? Four. Not so much. Another quartz. What do we pick up for another quartz? Twenty. That's a reasonable amount, isn't it? Okay that's it for today i think i'm i sort of um apologize because i really haven't achieved too much in the last bit which is not but i suppose that's part of how it works in this game uh, my arm is looking a bit fragile as well i'm going to lose these two bits very soon i would like to be able to repair that as well maybe i'll have to do some research how to repair what i've got anyway until next time i'm going to say bye for now